And I don't know what your fucking timeline of events are, but it seems to be a little off. Because you think that Tim is doing this for revenge, but Tim started this in the fucking first place. Remember? Because he would read my messages every day in his videos. But he wouldn't respond or anything, but he would want he wanted me to keep holding on, obviously, by by putting my messages, stuff from my messages every day in his video. And then there was the paw paw, the paw paw and the inversion table at the property. They're things that I said I wanted in Vegas. But you know, it's just like like it some kind of revenge that Tim's getting on me for something for my tactics. But I didn't have any tactics. When Tim showed up at my, my house, I was very sick. I couldn't even remember. See, this is how I got two days, or for two days, uh, yesterday, or the day before yesterday, maybe the day before that, or yesterday a little bit. Like, that's how I get. Like, that's how I spent... Uh, this is how I get, right? I can't keep my focus because I can't keep my focus. I don't have any kind of memory, right? And my memory is already jacked up in other ways anyway. But that's like the main reason that um, I'm not remembering anything is because I can never focus. And if I can't ever focus, I can't even remember what I'm doing. I can't do anything like that, right? Well, I spent um, like years being like this. And that's about the time Tim showed up to my house. So, if Tim wants to play games with me because I was sick, that's fucking fine. That's fucking weak. That's fucking everything. But, let him have his fucking karma for it. When Tim repeats the things that I say, oh, Allison had this good idea from a show. Oh, oh, Allison had this good idea for these cards. Oh, Allison had this... And what do you think your timeline is over this? This is over years and years and years of her, him repeating my ideas as hers and all this bullshit and her popping up randomly right before Austin uh, on the video in Austin and popping up randomly and making jelly when that's what I did and that's what I do and like... You, you say that's Kara's energy, but, like, literally what Allison has been doing for the past fucking five years. But Allison doesn't even have to do it. Tim will repeat the thing for her, which means he's not innocent either. And he belongs in prison, too, because he thinks it's fucking funny. He thinks it's fucking funny to steal from me in poverty as a millionaire. Let me repeat that to you. And now I've left Tim completely alone. Uh, don't even go to his show barely. And then when I do pop in there, I'll pop, post some stuff because he, he's always saying some bullshit. So I'll post some stuff on Twitter. And then uh, if I pop back in there, all of a sudden he's talking about what I'm ta what I said on Twitter. And it's like it's like an hour later. And I just pop back in there. Like what the fucking stalker shit is that? Okay? I don't want to hear y'all's fucking bullshit anymore. Gaslight me into thinking my life isn't fucking reality, Christina. You fucking dumb bitch. You had your chance. You fucked it up. You were at the fucking castle. You fucked it up. Fucking deal with it. Fucking cope. Fucking cope, bitch. Allison is not your friend. Tim is not your friend. Ian is not your friend. None of those people are your fucking friends. No, friends don't treat people like that. None of it. None of it. Maybe that's the lesson you need to learn, Christina. Because I don't have a problem cutting off everybody in my life. I don't have a problem with that. I don't have a problem spending time with me alone. I don't have a problem with that. I don't have a problem with that. But what, what, what I do have a problem with is fake ass motherfuckers like you acting like everybody's your fucking friend when none of them even like you.